Hey, this is Karen with your arm series. Start with your lightest weights in your hands. I would go with twos or threes. Bring your feet directly underneath your hips. Knees are slightly bent, shoulders back and down, abdominals pulled in. We start with a lateral raise. The arms go out to a T and down. The breath is exhale and inhale. Up and down. Good. Just this eight times. Hands come to the height of your shoulders every time. Up. Two more. Then I'm adding on. Take it back down, lateral. Long arms, bring it in, out, and down. On the in, your palms face each other. Again, no higher than shoulder height. Good, let's do this four times. Then we'll add on. Make sure you're not leaning back. Abdominals pulled in, knit your rib cage together. One more time, then I'm adding on. Good, take it down, here we go. Adding on two bicep curls, in, in, then out and down. So let's put it all together. Out, in, curl, curl, out and down. Again, when you curl, the emphasis is on the in. Don't worry about extending all the way. Just extend about three quarters of the way. So I pull in, extend, in, extend, out, and out. Now again. Let's go four times through. Three more. Nice, two more times, almost there. So this is our first combination, this is our bicep combination. Last time, then we change it. Nice. Arms down. Take a moment to roll your shoulders back. Bend your elbows. Arms are at 90 degree angles. This is your shoulder raise. Lift up and down. Good. Keep your arms at 90 degree angles. Bring your hands and elbows right up to the height of your shoulders. Four more. Three. Get ready to add on. Shoulder raise, rotator raise. Flip the hands up, bring them back down and in. Up, flip it up, nice. So my elbows don't move once they get into position. It's just a rotation from your shoulder. Let's go for four more, then we'll add on. Three. Two. Last one, like this, here we go. Okay, do it again. Two chest press, turn your palms into your face and out. In, now bring it back down, just like you started. Good, up, flip, in, out, in, out, and out. Turn your hands all the way, full rotation. When you come in for that chest press, lead with your elbows. So let's go for four more, one. In, out, in, out, and out. Nice, again. You got two more right here. So this is our second combination. This is the chest press combination. Last time. In, out, in, out, bring it down. Arms down by your sides. Take a moment to roll your shoulders back. So we have two combinations, the bicep combination, the chest press combination, we'll put it together. Here we go, arms out, lateral raise, bring it in, two biceps, out and down. Now shoulder raise, rotator raise. Two chest press, turn the hands all the way, and bring it back down, lateral raise. Bring the arms in, biceps, one, two, good. Shoulder, rotator. Chest press. Bring it down. Bicep curl combination, lateral and in. Two curls, out and down. Shoulder raise, rotator to your chest. You got it, here we go. From the top, bicep curl combination. In, out, in, out, and down. Shoulder raise, rotator raise. Chest, in, out, nice. Let's do this together 
four times. It's out. In. One. Two. And out. Shoulder raise. Rotator. Stay strong. We've only got three more. Then we'll change it up. Good. Lateral raise. Biceps. Woo. Good. Shoulder. Rotator. Two chest press. Keep the rest of the body totally stable as you work. Two more times. One, two, out and down. Shoulder raise, rotator, chest press. Turn the hands. Last time coming up, make it your best. Lateral raise, in, two curls. Out and down. Shoulder raise, rotator, chest press. Now listen, hold right here, stop and it's a little pulse. Up, 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 up. In five, six, seven. Full range, up and down. Good, exhale and inhale. Three, four, five, six, two more. Seven, bring it down to goal pose and hold for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Bring your arms down. Take a moment to roll your shoulders back. Shake your head now. Bring your feet a little bit wider. You can bend your knees just slightly and bring your hands up to the height of your shoulders. We'll punch it out. Right, left, right, left, good. Put a little power behind it, but keep your abdominals engaged so your torso stays stable. Let's go for a one, two, three, four to 10, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, arms down. Roll your shoulders back, shake your head no. Good, going into tricep work. Bend your knees just slightly and hinge forward from your hips. Stick out your butt, you'll look straight down at the floor so the back of your neck is not crunched. Anchor your elbows up to the ceiling. Elbows hug right into your sides. Exhale, extend your arms fully. Now instead of bringing your hands back into your chest, bring them just to the hip. Here we go, first singles, it's, it's dead and bend, it's dead and bend. Hands above your hips every single time. When you straighten out your arm fully, there's always a little hold. Here we go, extend and bend, extend and bend. Eight more, eight, seven, Five. Last one, hold. Stop right here. Keep your arms perfectly straight. Turn your palms down to the floor and pulse your arms up. Super straight, long arms. Four more right here, let's go for four. Three, now turn your palms in towards your hips. Press up, just like you did before. Four more. Turn your palms up to the ceiling and see if you can lift your hands just a little bit higher. Last four. Here we go, home stretch. Turn the palms in, circle up and around. Maybe you can get those arms just a little bit higher. Keep pushing. Last eight, reverse. Make sure you're still looking at the floor. Four more, and three, and two, and one. Bring it up. Roll your shoulders back. Last one in this series, it's your rhomboid raise, working your upper back. Feet close together. Bend your knees, just like we did in triceps. Hinge forward from the hips. Arms are straight, your arms stay straight through this whole series. Abdominals pulled in, arms out to a T, straight out to the side. Exhale, inhale, nose pointed down. Out and down, good. Squeeze your shoulder blades together as you get to the top. Let's go for last eight, seven. Keep breathing. Keep lengthening your spine. Four more. Three, on the last one you'll hold. Two, take it up and pulse for eight, seven, six, five, keep going, four, three, Two, one, nice job. Bring it up and roll your shoulders back. Place these light weights down for a moment. Let's take a moment to take a shoulder stretch. 
Bring your right arm in front of your chest. Pull it in towards you. Make sure your shoulder is dropped away from your ear. So just let it relax, pull it in. Breathe, let's switch. Other arm, shoulder away from the ear, pull it in. Nice job, good. All right, we switch weights to your heavier pair. Between five and eight, I'm gonna go with my six pound weights for bicep curl series. Again, bring your feet directly underneath your hips. Abdominals pulled in, shoulders back and down. My palms start facing into my hip. When I lift up to the shoulder, I turn my palms into my shoulder. So you get a full range of motion every time. We start slow, up two, down two. Exhale up on two, inhale down. Up on two, full range of motion. Let your arms straighten out every time. Up, down, good. We've got four more like this, then we'll pick up the pace. Three. One more time. Think tall, stand tall. Singles, let's go, it's up and down. Exhale, inhale. You wanna keep your elbows right by your sides, right by the seam of the shirt. Let's go four more, then we'll change the range of motion. Four, three, two, it's halfway up and all the way down. Halfway and down. Be specific about stopping right at the height of your elbows. Four more, then we'll change it. Three, two, all the way up, halfway down. Up, halfway, nice. As your weights come down, think about standing a little bit taller. Four more, four, three, Two, all the way down, all the way up for eight. Keep breathing. As it gets harder, start to work a little bit harder. Get ready to work the mid range. Here we go, not quite all the way up, not quite all the way down. You don't have to turn your hands at all here. Palms face up the whole time. Almost all the way up, almost all the way down. Let's go for eight, seven, Five, four, three, two more, two. Bring it all the way down, finish with an up two, down two. Just like we started, and down, on two. Again, up, on two. Good, keep your elbows right back by the seam of your shirt. We've got four more till we change it. It's up, and inhale down. Nice, you're almost there. Finish strong with me, two more. One more time. Up, on two, and down. Now hold right here. Roll your shoulders back, hitting the bicep from a different angle. Turn your palms out to the walls. Let your arms hang straight. We start slow. Up, two, down, two. Here we go. Up, on two, and down, on two. Nice, so as you pull it up, you're making two V shapes with your arms. Four more, right here. Up, two down. Last two. Full range of motion every single time. Here comes singles and it's up, down. Exhale, inhale, nice. As it gets heavier, try to engage your core even more deeply. Pull your abdominals in and up. Two more, then we'll decrease the range of motion. Halfway up, all the way down, halfway. And down, good, halfway, and down. Nice, I know it's getting intense. Stay with me. Home stretch. Two more like this. Now all the way up and halfway down. All the way up, halfway. Good, two, three, four, five. Whew. Two more, seven, singles, let's go. All the way up, all the way down, two, Three, four, five, six, seven. Work your mid range. We go not quite all the way up, not quite all the way down. This is it. We'll finish with pulses after your next four. One, two, three. Bring your hands right up to the height of your elbows. Hands go down an inch, 
up an inch, down an inch, up an inch. Come on, stay strong. Give me four more. Let's go four, up, three, up. You got this, two, up, one, up and all the way down. Nice job, you guys. Place those weights down for just a moment. Extend your right arm along in front of you. Without pulling on your fingers, just draw them down. And take a stretch through your bicep, front of the arm. Switch it, other arm long in front of you. Draw your fingers down. We are going into single arm rows. You can use your heavier weight, or you can double up your weights, holding both of your uh, heavy and light weight in one hand. So let's take the left foot forward and your left elbow right on your quad. Allow the right arm to hang down by your side. Here we go, let's start. Up and down. Exhale as you pull up and back. Not only are you pulling your elbow up to the ceiling, you're drawing it back towards your spine. When your arms goes down, extend it down a little bit further to increase your range of motion. So your hand is almost going all the way down to the floor. So we've got 16. Abdominals are in tight. Let's go last 10. Hug that arm right into your side, grazing your rib cage. Last four, here we go. Strong finish. Three, two, one. Stand it up, switching sides. Holding your weights together. This time, right foot in front. Elbow on your quad, spine is long. Extend your arm almost all the way down. Here we go, let's start. Pull it up and back. Exhale, inhale. Your rib cage rotates around your spine. Good, second set right here. Make sure your arm goes fully straight every time it extends down to the floor. Halfway there, 16 more. Almost there, here comes last eight, seven, six, in four, three, two, and last one, nice job. That's it for your weights. Place your weights down. And let's come to push-up position. Your push-up series is long. So you can start on your toes. You may need to come down on your knees. Otherwise, you can start on your knees. Your first series is down on four, up on four, followed by down two, up two, down two, up two. I'll cue it, listen up. Your hands are almost as wide as your mat. Fingertips turn slightly in. If your knees are bent, pull your heels towards your butt. Let's start down on four. It's inhale down, two, three, four. Press up. It's down two, up two. Here we go. Down two and up. Down two, down for four. Down two, three, four. Slowly up. Good, keep leading with your chest. Keep your heads up. Down two, down two, up two. Nice. Let's do it again, super slow, down four. And up, stay with me, down two. And up, again. Final one in this series, take it slow, down four. Slowly up, down two, up two, big range of motion. Let's go, down two, up two, last one, down two, up two, nice job, sit back. Take a quick stretch in child's pose, arms long in front of you. For your next series, we pick up the pace. It's down two, up two, followed by two singles, okay? Here we go, set it up. In five, six, 
seven, down two. We take it down, two, and up. Two singles. Again, slow, down two. Here come your singles. Slow it down, down two. Singles, good, keep going, slow. Try to bring your chest all the way down to the height of your elbows, singles. Let's do a couple more, down two. Two singles, here we go. Last time like this, slowly down two. Up two, two singles, down. And done, sit back. That's your second in three sets. Next one, single, pulse one, two, three, and push yourself back up. Here we go, set it up. This is your last set, so give me all you got here. Five, six, it's your single. Down and up, three pulses, one, two, three, long arms. It's single, pulse three. Again, single, pulse. Single, pulse again. Check out your head, keep it up in line with your spine. Single, pulse. Good, you guys, let's do this two, two more times. Single, pulse. Last time, pulse it down. One, two, three. Nice job, sit it back. Woo. Let's take a moment to stretch out our chest. You can sit back on your heels, bring your arms out to a T, open the chest, interlace your fingers behind your back, bend your elbows, now extend your arms, open your collarbone, see if you can bring your elbows, uh, bend your elbows again and bring your hands up a little bit higher. Last in this series is our tricep dips. Sitting on your butt, take your hands behind you with your thumbs pointing towards your butt. Fingers can be out to the sides. Feet are flat, feet are pretty close together. Roll your shoulders back, lift your hips, extend your hip flexors, bend your elbows and extend. It's bend and extend. Now when you extend, don't extend all the way. You don't wanna lock out the elbow. You wanna keep it just slightly soft on the up. Good. Down and up. Let's go for four more. Four, three, two, now hold right here, just an option. Cross your right ankle over your left quad. This time you'll bend your elbows and on the way up, extend the right leg. Here we go. Bend, extend. Try to touch the ceiling. This is eight, we got two more. Bend your elbows, nice. Make sure the arms are still moving. Hold here, place that foot down. Cross the other leg over, it's bent. Extend, two, you got it, three. We are almost done with the arm series. Four more, four, three, two. Even longer leg, hold it right here. Place that foot down. You can stay right where you are or even more advanced option, extend your right leg long in front. Extend your left arm, little pulses. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, Three, two, one, and you're done. Nice job. Cross your legs, roll your shoulders back, and let's take a tricep stretch. Reach your right arm straight up to the ceiling. Find your length. Reach your right fingertips down your back. Press your elbow down and back. And breathe and just hold. You can add a lateral stretch. Bring it back up, release. Left arm up to the ceiling, find your length. Reach down your back, press your elbow down, take the tricep stretch, and take a lateral stretch. Let's bring both arms up to the ceiling. One hand on the floor and take a lateral stretch, arm connecting to the ear as you push the floor away with the hand that's on your mat. Bring both arms up, other hand on the floor, arm to ear, Take a lateral stretch, anchoring both hips into the floor. Bring your arms up, out, and down. Great job. 